The Ashanti Regional Minister, Honorable Simon Osei Mensa, has informed that the disinfection and fumigation exercise in all police stations and barracks in the region is part of several measures and programs put in place to improve upon the environmental and health situation of the country. He spoke that the attention of the implementation is to get rid of microorganisms like bacteria and viruses together with rodents and insects to give the station a serene working environment for the officers of the law. With the advent of COVID-19, several measures and programs have been put in place to improve upon our environment and health situation of the country. The whole disinfection of all markets and lorry parks during the lockdown period. Let me state that the current exercise we are going to have is fumigation and disinfection. The one for the markets and lorry parks was only disinfection. And the other for the schools had both components, disinfection and fumigation. The difference between the two is that in the case of disinfection, the focus is on microorganisms like bacteria, virus, etc. But in the case of fumigation, it includes rodents, insects, and many others. So this current exercise is targeting both, both microorganisms, insects, rodents, etc. The contractor that is undertaking this project is Zoom Lion Ghana Limited. My request to the personnel of the police service is to give them maximum cooperation for a successful program. And on behalf of the Ashanti Regional Coordinating Council, Otunfo and the Chiefs, the Regional Police Administration and the people of the region, we wish to express our sincere gratitude and appreciation to the government for this exercise and the honor done us. I'm saying honor done us because this is the first region that they are starting with. And we are privileged. We are lucky during the disinfection and fumigation of the senior high schools. It also started in this region. So we are grateful to the president and the government. And we are also grateful to Zoom Line for always selecting our region as the first point of call. The Ashanti Regional Police Command on Tuesday, May 19, 2020, launched a disinfection and fumigation exercise in all police stations and barracks in the Ashanti region. Zoom Lion Ghana Limited collaborate with the security institution to carry the exercise across the 158 police stations and will be effected within five days beginning from Tuesday. Sori News was at the Rich and Menshia Divisional Police Station to witness the execution of the mandate by Zoom Lion. The Ashanti region is the first to commence the cleansing and the minister assured of maximum cooperation for a successful program to help confine the novel pandemic. He urged all Ghanaians to keep observing the protocols outlined by the Ministry of Health, detailing that the wearing of masks is mandatory at public places and people who flout by them would be punished. The whole detail is that anybody caught in public place without wearing face masks is giving an instant social work to do, either cleaning, the salting of gutters or whatever, or picking of letters. And we thank all that the media 
you've given us the greater support and listening to the airways the people of the region even feel we've delayed in taking such an action the drivers of commercial vehicles please if you are caught without wearing the face marks or any of the passengers in your on board your vehicle is without face marks both of you will be sanctioned and you do almost the same exercise we are pleading with everybody let's observe the social distancing let's avoid some activities that are prohibited under the COVID. He cautioned community football players to desist from the act given that it is life-threatening in such a time of coronavirus. Honorable Osei Mensa appealed to flouters not to justify themselves with the regulations of public gathering because engagement in football activities is part of the unlawful act under COVID-19. When you drive around, you still witness people playing cards, ludo, draft, and even some playing football, please. If you are arrested by the security agencies, you also go through the same sanctions as being meted on those that have been arrested without wearing face masks. Because social gatherings are not allowed. Those who have been playing football under the guise that the president said at least 25 people can meet. I'm telling you and saying again and clarifying what the president said. The president said 20, maximum 25 people can undertake private barrier. Please, private barrier. Not any other activity. It's only for private barrier. So those who play football and see that you have 11 on inside making 22 plus a referee making 23 plus two linesmen making 25 please you are not included it's only for private barrier so if you play football you are breaching the law or the one of the directives that is on social gathering so let's get away from all these illegalities let's all help each other to ensure that we contain the covid 19 pandemic in the country uh, we are fumigating and disinfecting 158 police facilities within the region and uh, we're going to use five days for this exercise uh, we've gone round with uh, our teams to visit all the police facilities and uh, we, come, we came out with a strategy that will help uh, facilitate the, the exercise uh, so that the police can move in at uh, about 1 hour 30 minutes back to their various offices. I think we've made one or two observations. Uh, uh, there are offices, they need it as early as possible. So we advise that uh, as, as we finish this uh, lunch, they move out quickly for us to do the disinfection. Then we will move to their uh, uh, barracks to do more of the uh, fumigation because where, that's where we will uh, find more of the, uh, the rodents, and the insects. So uh, from there, our men have been grouped into about six, and they will be moving to the various facilities to do the disinfection.